Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you may be. It's like your warlord. Stash. Hello, everyone. Hope you're doing well. Let me adjust these volumes real quick. Okay. Uh, really weird topic to talk about. Uh, I'm not going to be playing Townstar uh, going into perpetuity unless they change what we're going to talk about today as quickly as possible, which is their terms and conditions that they've just uploaded for the Townstar competition. Now, you might say to yourself, well, they've always had terms and conditions, and you'd be right. They've had uh, TOS for the website, TOS for note owners, but they never had one for Town Stars competition itself, Common Ground Worlds competition. Now you might ask yourself, why all of a sudden do they have terms and conditions? I would imagine it has to do with all the legal stuff they're going through. Perhaps the uh, the tax stuff that they hid, or maybe it's the SEC investigation. I don't know, but let's talk about it. Here we go. Charlie, once again, a map Discord. I'm not going to go over the uh, competition details, if you want to go over them, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, go go over them. Uh, 40 gas, that's all great and all, but here's the big news. Event TNC can be found here. So let's click that link, and you'll see we have Common Ground World Weekly Contest. How to enter. I'm on the wrong side. Let's put me on the correct side now. There we go. That's a little better. Actually, if we do like this, it doesn't matter. Okay, I'm always going to be in the way. Great. Let's go back to the other side. How to enter. Uh, you have to play the game during this period. So that yellow is going to get updated constantly every time there's a new uh, competition. Cool. Uh, reference links. Uh, incomplete, false, or deceptive entries are void. So if you're a bot, hopefully you'll be, you, you won't be. They, they, don't have, they don't have the technology to pick up any voids, uh, any bots. Uh, we'll be a Pixed uh, Discord channel. Well, you can't get into Discord, good luck. Hope you can figure it out. Sponsor's computer will serve as the official timekeeping device for this promotion. Huh, all right. So you got to trust on them. Got it. All entrants receive a notification. They must currently have an account. They play the game and place in top 1,200. If you meet the criteria, you'll be part of the prize pool. And they have URLs here. Now, here's where it starts to get interesting. Eligibility. The promotion is open to legal residents of the United States, excluding Arizona, Arkansas, Connecticut, Delaware, Louisiana, Montana, South Carolina, South Dakota, and Tennessee, and the District of Columbia, and who are the age of residency. Now, uh, that means I can't play. Just in case you're wondering, I'm in Louisiana. So uh, if I had to guess, their biggest uh, detractors uh, live in these states. <laughs> So they found a way to cut us out of the thing. So I'm no longer going to be playing Town Star due to these new terms and conditions. Uh, employees of sponsors and its advertising, uh, they are not allowed to. Um, void where prohibited. Now, I'm not going to say it's Gala's fault. This is probably something to do with uh, online gambling or something, or maybe something to do with crypto. Not too sure. But uh, yeah, I can't play the game anymore. Uh, selecting the winner's notification. This is all standard. Uh, they get to decide who's legal and who's not. Uh, odds of winning depend on the number of eligible entrants. Winner to respond. Uh, okay. Failure of potential prize winner to respond to such notification or reporting issues. Receiving the prize within 30 days will result in disqualification. So if you haven't gotten it in 30 days and you don't let them know, uh, which sucks because their tech support's not very good, so you probably would just be shit out of luck, period. Alternate potential winners shall be contacted by email as soon as practical, uh, practical as soon as in 30 days. Any An entrant is not a winner of any prize unless entrance eligibility has been verified, which may require execution and return of an affidavit of eligibility and publicity and liability release consistent with the terms herein as determined at the company's sole discretion. And the entrant has been notified, verification completed as winner. So a lot more bullshit jargon. General conditions. Uh, except we're prohibited by entering the promotion or accepting a prize. Each entrant hereby irre 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 irrevocably grants to the sponsor, Gala Games, the promotion entities, and each of their licensees and sub-licensees, affiliates and assigns, collectively the licensed parties, an irrevocable, royalty-free, and fully paid-up right and license, inclusive of the right to grant further sub-licenses, but not obligation, to use the entrant's name... Photograph, likeness, social media handles, statements, voice, and biographical information related hereunto, which are submitted, provided, posted, or otherwise used in connection with the promotion and or use or enjoyment of any prize materials 
throughout the universe in perpetuity in any and all media, whether now or hereafter known or devised, for any or other purposes, including but not limited to commercial or advertising purposes, without review, credit permission, or further compensation or consideration. So that's extremely important. By competing in this and accepting a prize from Gala Games, you are now giving them permission to use you as an online person in perpetuity for anything that they want. I do not consent to that, Gala, so until you change this out of your terms and conditions, besides the fact that I'm in Louisiana, I would not be playing. And I would, I would ask you, the player that is considering playing, is that worth it? Is it worth giving Gala your soul? No, it's not. And then it furthers on prizes and taxes, discusses that, and applicable taxes, etc., etc. Uh, sponsored promotion, do not make any warranty guarantee, limitations of liability. And then here's the final thing I wanted to point out because I would ask you to go read this yourself. I'm also running out of time. Jury trial waiver. Expect this prohibited by law and as conditioned to participating in this promotion. You waive any right that he, she, they may have to a trial by jury in respect to any allegation directly or indirectly arising out of, under, or in connection with this promotion, any document or agreement entered into connection herewith. So if you don't have any, you have any issues with this document, go fuck yourself. Guess what? You just signed a waiver saying that you can't, you can't take them to trial. Now you say, well, like, and they've had stuff like that before in the terms of service. Yes, they've had it. Terms of service that said you can't do a class action lawsuit, but we'll go ahead and I'll prove my point real quick. All right, we have the gala terms of service that I got on December 16th, 2022. Let's go for jury. Let's go and search for the word jury. Okay. Class action waiver. This is the part I'm referring to. Notice there's only one result. I know it's kind of hard for you to see, but there's only one result in this. Class action waiver. To the extent permissible by law, all claims must be brought in a party's individual capacity and not as a plaintiff or class member may purport a class, collection action, etc., etc. So each party waives the right to trial by jury and the right to participate in a class action. So they do have that in there. I was wrong. Each party, uh, user acknowledges that by agreeing to these terms, each party waives the right to a trial by jury and right to... So I was wrong. They do have it in there. Okay. Well... Regardless, I don't think you should do it. Uh, I think it's, uh, I mean, this is just to use the account, right? Okay, fine. Uh, great. You can't, you can't do it. Any disputes must be brought. Class action waiver. See, that's the thing, though. This is part of the class action waiver. That's what, I, that's what I'm getting at. I think the trial by jury and the right to participate in a class action, I think that's, I think that's bundled together. I don't think it's, un, it's individual. Let's, like, uh, like it is what we're looking at over here. You know what I'm saying? I, I think it's different. But either way, this is just playing Townstar. So, uh, again, I would uh, I would question uh, what the fuck they're doing. All right? So, that all being said, I'm not going to be playing anymore. Good luck to all of you. Uh, I hope you read these. I'm going to put that link in the description. I would encourage you to read it yourself before you participate in any more town star competitions. Got any questions? You can leave them down below. Discord is the easiest way to get a hold of me. You can drop that link. It's going to be down below. Got links if you want to support the channel. Regardless, I hope you're all doing well. I will see you soon. We got more videos coming. There's so much stuff to talk about. Woo! I'm liking Warlord. A stash! I love you all. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>
You made it to the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching this video. I want to shout out my Patreons. Patreons from Patreon. And my new YouTube members as well. I got that going. Appreciate all of you. Thank you so very much. Your help has been crucial to keeping me alive and keep streaming and keep helping and hopefully entertaining you along the way. Anything I can do to make it more worth your while, please let me know down below. Also, you can find me on my Discord. I have my Discord server link down below. Patreon links down below, and then membership should be somewhere around here. Thank you all so very, very much. I really appreciate you, and I look forward to the future, and I hope you will come along for this journey with me. Thank you. Take care.